Hi, let's see how to fix the Discord stream bitrate issue. Experiencing the issues with the Discord stream bitrate can be frustrating, especially when it affects the quality of your content. Bitrate issues often manifest as fixations, stuttering, or puffering during the streams. The issue occurs for a variety of reasons, often related to the settings and the conditions under which you are streaming. So let's see what causes the Discord stream bitrate issue. The first cause is internet connection. The second cause is network congestion. The third cause is incorrect bitrate settings. The fourth cause is server location. The fifth cause is hardware limitations. So let's see how to fix the Discord stream bitrate issue. The first method is check your internet connection. Make sure that you have a proper internet connection with very good speed and a very good bandwidth. If you are having a poor internet connection, try to reset your router to the modem. That will fix any kind of bugs or the glitches present in your internet connection. But still, if you are facing the issue, you can contact the internet service provider for further assistance. They have the expertise, they will help you to fix the problem and they will give you the better solution. The second method is adjust the discount bitrate settings, lower the bitrates users, use the less data, which can be beneficial if there is many users in the voice channel helping to reduce the overall bandwidth usage and uh, potential strain on the Discord servers. For lower bitrate, bit open the Discord, click on the voice channel name, navigate to the bitrate bit and slide a lower you tab. If your current bitrate is set higher, try lowering it incrementally from 96 to 64. Remember that the Discord maximum bitrate depends on the server level and whether you have the need Discord Nitro. For lower frame rates, before streaming into the server, click on the Steam Preview to access the Steam Quality settings. Select the resolution and the frame rate that match your Discord Nitro level and your internet upload speed. The third method is re reduce the Steam Quality. Lowering the Steam Quality can reduce the demand for your bitrate, leading to the smoother stream. When you start streaming on the Discord, click on the Screen button at the bottom of the Voice Channel window. Choose the application or the screen you wish to share. Before clicking go live, select a lower resolution frame rate stream quality before settings. The fourth method is close the unnecessary application. Make sure that you are not using any other unnecessary application. If you are using the unnecessary application, try to close it. The fifth method is update your network and the graphic drivers. So new drivers often include the optimization for the latest games, which can increase the frame rates and overall performance. Updates can resolve the known issues and the glitches that might affect your graphic card leading to the more stable system. Outdated network drivers can cause the various connection issues. Visit the network adapter manufacturer website to download and install the latest drivers. Okay, so in order to do that, follow these steps sequentially one by one. The sixth method is uh, optimize the Discord's advanced video codec settings. Disabling the advanced video codec settings is an extra feature that increases the bandwidth and the GPU RAM usage to get the seamless experience. If you have any issues with the streaming, then disabling the settings fixes the issues. In the Discord, go to the user settings, voice and video. Advanced section, disable any experimental video codecs that may be causing the issue. The seventh method is this clear the disk caches. Clearing the caches will remove the temporary files and improve the overall performance of the application. Make sure the Discord is completely closed and not running in the background. Open the current dialog. Select all the files in the cache folder and delete them. Right click on the recycle bin to empty the trash. Eighth method is uninstall and reinstall the Discord app. If all else fails, try uninstalling the Discord app and then again you can reinstall it by downloading from where you are downloading previously. That will fix any kind of bugs on the glitch present in the application or the system. Download the Discord app, uninstall the Discord app, clear remaining Discord files, and then, then you can uninstall it. So go to the Discord website, click on download for Windows, uninstall the Discord, put the Windows key passar, type this particular command, find the Discord list, select uninstall, follow the prompts to complete the uninstallation process. In order to clear the remaining Discord files, press the Windows key passar, print, type this command, locate the Discord folder, delete it, repeat this process by tapping this shutdown and restart the system to clear any temporary files and finalize the uninstallation process. Right click on the downloaded Discord file and select uh, run as administrator for all the instruction steps outlined above the 
download and install the latest version of the disk. Okay, so that's all about this. Thank you.